everyone welcome back to my channel this is Dora the fluid crafter and um, I have some happy mail today and I have a few other things that I want to show you I got the camera kind of zoomed in uh, on this one so um, I marked I blacked out the address but um, I want a little giveaway on Instagram and it's from Miss Rhonda Coleman I'll link her Instagram down below she is super super creative and I just recently found her um, her page on Instagram and she is so sweet and so nice guys so um, yes yeah, so I wanted to open it up with you and look at how she decorated this envelope is that not the cutest look at these that is so sweet and on the back it's got a little Valentine stuff and it says happy mail I want these stamps so bad oh okay so anyways let's open it up and see what's inside if we can open it up <laughs> You know what? Let me get my little exacto here. Let's see if we can get up under. There we go. Yeah. Because I don't want to rip it too much. There we go. Okay, now we got it, guys. Now we got it. Now we got it. Okay, and that is empty. Oh, gosh, look at this. I'm actually, I think I'm going to cut this right down the middle, and I think I'm going to put this in my little correspondence uh, journal because that is just too cute. Too cute. Okay, so let's see here. There's a little envelope. Oh, it's a thank you card. Look at that. Oh, you inspire me. Look at that stamp. That is beautiful. And I can reuse this red envelope too. I'm going to put that in my journal also so I can keep that. And then here is, look at these. They're so cute. <laughs> absolutely, absolutely cuteness. I'm not a big Valentine's Day person, guys. I'll be completely honest with you. It has just gotten to be where it's not even about sweethearts anymore. Everyone is doing Valentine's Day like kids and um, family members. I mean, you know, I just, I'm like, okay, well, Valentine's Day is supposed to be for sweethearts, but, you know. It's not anymore, and so to me, it, I don't know, it just doesn't seem as special. And so there's some washi on this um, on this bag, and since this is a plastic bag, I can get that washi off, and I think I'm going to use this washi. So I'm going to sit that to the side, and look, guys, look at these little buttons. Oh my gosh, these are so adorable. Uh, I don't have any mini teeny buttons like that anymore. I used all mine, so that is super cool. And look at these little bows. Oh. <laughs> and there's a little key. Love that little key. I'm all about steampunk, so you know I like my keys. Little heart. Oh, two little hearts. This is a little felt heart, which is also super cool. I don't have anything that's felt anymore. Again, I used all my felt stuff. Um, and then these tickets. Oh, love tickets. I'm a big ticket person love them I like these two because these are open you can stamp on them love that oh and here's a little pink bow oh so pretty and I love bingo look at that <laughs> these are so cute guys these are so cute look at this the key to my heart belongs to you that is super cool and here's a little um, uh, a pink plaid. Now you know I like my plaid too. Um, the library card. That is super cool. Love that. And a pink guest check. I'm running out of guest checks. Look at this little dually. <laughs> that is super cool too. I don't have any small ones either. And here is another little envelope. With a little I love you in there. Yes, that is super cool.
cool. Thank you so much, Rhonda. This is beautiful. Thank you for these little tidbits and pieces. I will absolutely use them. And I will do a video while I'm using them so you can see what we come up with. Let me pick these up here so I don't lose them. We're going to sit those to the side really fast. Okay, so that was that. Um, and then I have, um, I wanted to show you guys what I did for my design team project for Thoughtful Studios. Her name is Marie. Super wonderful lady. And she has this Tessa Pen Pal Happy Mail type kit. I will link her also down below. She's got a uh, discount code. For her design team members to give away to all of her followers and for her Etsy shop so I will also leave that discount code down below so um, this one here is these here are just envelopes that I made for happy milk because I mean really who doesn't like to get happy meal right and so I just took a piece of the pattern paper and covered the front and then here I put a thanks for the happy mail like you know as if you're returning some to someone or doing a swap and then just the two in the front and then I did a little gold embossing filigree right there on the back I did some more um, gold embossing and then um, this here is a little like uh, word plate that says snail mail two little envelopes there and then of course I put some um, washi around the top so it wouldn't stick together so I could show you guys inside is just a piece of paper that you could write a letter or something that says thank you you probably can't see it on camera but this paper has these little sketched teacups oh it's so beautiful I love tea teacups teapots all that kind of stuff so that was really cool to have in there so there's the first envelope and then here is the second one it's an airmail envelope and the colors went so well with this kit, so I had to use it. Um, this one, same thing, just use some of the pattern paper. Over the um, airmail logo, I just put Happy Mail, one of the little ephemera pieces, two little envelopes, a just for you, two little stamps here. And on the back, I just put two butterflies and just kind of decorated it, you know, you know, the same way we do when we send Happy Mail. And then here it says be my pen pal so if you get if you do happy mail swaps with someone and you want to be their pen pal or write to them or you know just kind of keep in touch that way that's a perfect little ephemera piece to put on there and then when you open this one up look at all these beautiful beautiful images on there isn't that lovely guys that is so lovely Oh my goodness. Beautiful, beautiful papers. Okay, so there's the second one. And then this one here, I just took a, um, a blue envelope. I used the blue, red, and yellow um, paper with the envelopes on it. And just decorated it pretty much the same way. This one here, I actually put a stamp on because I am going to be using this envelope to send to someone. I just put my addresses so people could see. I'll cover this one up when I send it out. And on the back here, it's a little bit different. Most people open it from the top. I thought, well, if they wanted to keep this, why not open it from the bottom? So if they attach it, they could flip it up, right? Like in their journal or something or flip it to the side. So I wanted to keep that option open. And so I just put some little ephemera pieces and then it's just popped into the right back soon. Again, some little washi. And then I put in a big piece of paper here with these leaves and flowers. And of course it matches the envelope. Isn't that neat? I love this paper, guys. I can't say it enough. Can't say it enough. And so I will be doing another design team project for Thoughtful Studios soon. Um, so there's that. Um, don't forget to check her out in the description box below. So there is those. And I also wanted to just kind of do a small announcement here. Uh, so this will be a quick little video. Uh, don't forget that I'm doing a giveaway. 
um, I will link the giveaway video down below. Um, you have to remember that you have to be a subscriber, a visible subscriber. You have to like that video. You have to comment on that video with hashtag the fluid crafter. And you have to either do a VR and announce my YouTube channel or send someone whatever um, or share it to Facebook and Instagram. If you share them to any of your channels, please be sure to let me know so I can go and see them. Okay, because I won't know unless you tell me or tag me so I get the notification. Um, okay, so there's that section. And then the last section that I want to talk about is um, I am still going through my grieving process for my brother and his passing. And so there's going to be a lot of videos, unless it's an announcement or a tutorial where I'm showing and explaining something, my videos are going to be a craft with me, journal with me, where I just play music and then speed it up and then, you know, do the crafting. So that a way I can um, uh, journal with his memory and put his pictures and things like that um, into the journals that I have and the new ones that I'm making. And so I do want to do that. I, I really need to do that. Um, there's going to be some design team projects that um, have uh, page layouts um, with the materials that are included in the design team uh, um, kits and things that I'm, I'm going to be using. So uh, be on the lookout for those, but I will put in the, um, the title and the description box everything that you need to know about what I'm doing in the video and if I'm using uh, any digi kits from my design teams. So I hope you guys have a wonderful, wonderful day. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment down below. If you see something that I'm making and you want to know how to do it, please don't hesitate to send me a message and let me know and I will absolutely do a tutorial. Thanks guys. Bye-bye now.